So today I have a really exciting video because this is my very first kit unboxing. You know, just a blank kit. I've done lots of box openings on my channel, but of course this one's going to be different because this is a blank baby instead of a finished reborn. And I have been telling you all for a long time that I'm going to be starting reborning myself. For this baby, I do not know if she will be my first baby I reborn or not. She probably won't be because I think she'll be a little bit harder to paint than some others. But I will be reborning her sometime soon, I know. Um, so let's just get started because I'm so excited about this. Alright. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at this. You guys see how big this baby is? I mean, look, look at her little feet. Oh my gosh. Her feet are so detailed though. Hold on, I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to try to. My camera will focus for me. There we go. Look at the details on those feet. I'll probably do a kit review for you guys. If you want to see a kit review of this kit. Um, let's see. So here's the other leg. Whoops. I'm probably was out of camera there. <laughs> but here is the other leg. And let's see. I'm trying to find her arms next. Here we go, found them. Alright two outstretched hands. She has super detailed little um, wrinkles on her hand and you guys can probably see it from there. But I will do a details video of this kit if you guys request it. So let me know down below if you guys want to see a details video of this kit or a kit review. This is just a kit box opening. There's the other one. Here is her torso. And from her torso, you guys can probably tell who she is. She is a toddler, and she's a crawler. So she is the Amelia from Bountiful Baby, I believe. She was sculpted by Donna Rupert. And very, very cute. And then here is her body. Her body is huge all by itself, so she's definitely going to be a big baby. Alright, so let's look at her face now. Wow. She is big, you guys. Holy moly, she's huge. I don't know if I like this upturned face, but I've heard that when you put her on the torso, you can tilt her head down more. Wow. She's huge. I love that smile. Very cute. And she has two little teeth in there. Yeah. I don't know a name for her yet. One problem I also have is uh, I really want to cut the little spots so I can put her eyes in, but I don't have that well of vision and I don't want to accidentally like cut myself with an exacto knife. So, oh, I'm going to show you guys her eyes really quick because I do have her eyes already. I got them the other day. So I'm just going to take one out and I'm going to try to get my camera to focus. So here are the eyes I picked for her. Actually, I had a friend help me pick them. But they're really pretty blue. And I really wish I could put her eyes in. But I can't because I don't have... Um, I can't use an X-Acto knife. Um, anyway, those are really pretty eyes. And they're a polyglass. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And I hope to have an update on this little girl soon. Well, this big girl. She's so big compared to all my other babies. But, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys.